Okay, so we have the information about rhombus angles and diagonals. Now let's get started to calculate the side of rhombus. In this question, it's given that PQRS is a rhombus. Okay, if this is P, this is Q, then R, then S. Then just connect all these points and we can say that PQRS is the rhombus and the diagonals of this rhombus intersect at O. Right, if this is the rhombus. And the diagonals, these are the diagonals PR and SQ. And both of these intersect at O. This is the point of intersection. We know the property of a rhombus, the diagonals intersect each other equally and at 90 degree. Also given angle P as 120 degree and OP as 3 centimeter. So here this angle is 120 degree, right? A rhombus is also a parallelogram, right? So we can say the opposite angles of a parallelogram are always equal, right? So, we need to find the side of this rhombus. This is the question which is asked to us. We know the property of a rhombus that all the four sides of a rhombus are always equal. That means PQ equal to QR equal to RS equal to SP. Right? So, this is the, these are the properties which is known to us. Now, here you can see the diagonal will be bisecting this angle P. So we can say that this angle is 60 degree that means angle RPQ is 60 degree similarly since the opposite angles of a parallelogram are equal and rhombus is the parallelogram so angle R is also 120 degree and half of this is angle PRQ which is also 60 degree. Now the third angle angle Q will be 60 degree because the sum of all angles of a triangle is 180 degree and we can we have already deducted the value of angle rpq and angle prq and when you add all these three angles and equate it with 180 degree we get the value of angle q right so the third angle of this triangle prq is calculated as 60 degree and triangle prq is declared as one as equilateral so we are writing the same over here in triangle PRQ angle RPQ plus angle PRQ plus angle Q will be add up to get 180 degree this will give you putting up the value of 60 60 for RPQ and PRQ we get the value of angle Q which is 60 degree right now with this we prove triangle PRQ as equilateral and we see the diagonals of a rhombus bisect each other equally so the length of op is given 